To begin the enrolment process, you'll first need to access your student portal, known as Udo. You can access Udo from the University of Derby's website at derby.ac.uk. From here, scroll to the bottom of the web page, whereupon you'll find a link titled Udo. Log in with your account details, which will be your student number, followed by the password you have just created. This will take you to the student portal. Once you have logged in, you will see a collection of tiles. But please note that depending on your program type, you may see a different collection of tiles and you'll only see the tiles that are relevant to you. From the online enrollment guide, you can find more information on the stages of the enrollment and further guidance on how to enroll. If you need any support throughout the enrollment process, please contact the enrollment team via udol enrollment at derby.ac.uk or by calling 01332 594 000 and selecting option 4. The FAQ tile is where you'll find answers to a variety of key frequently asked questions. The recognition of prior learning tile will provide you with key information you will need in order to apply for exemptions for prior experience or studies. If you are wishing to apply for RPL, then please note this can take up to two months and you can only apply for RPL once you have been accepted onto the course. It is therefore recommended not to apply for your first module of study, as the decision may not be able to be made before your studies begin. Your study pattern tile will link you through to the main website. You will then need to select your relevant study pattern. When you are in your study pattern, you'll be able to see a list of the relevant modules for your program, the order in which to take them and any optional modules you may have to choose. It is useful to keep this page open in a separate tab or browser ready to refer to as you complete your enrollment in order to ensure you enroll to the correct modules for your program. Please note, that if you are enrolling in our January intake, you only need to add your spring and summer modules for this year. If you are enrolling onto our May intake, you will only need to add your summer modules for this year. You will be asked to enroll every academic year, so you only need to add modules for your first year of study. To complete your enrollment, you'll need to select the Enroll Now tile where you'll be able to access the online enrollment portal by logging in with your student ID and password. Once inside the portal, select the Enrollment Stroke Student Center tile to begin. You'll now be directed through a series of screens. While some of the questions may not seem relevant, they are required data and you will need to complete them to complete your enrollment. The first screen is where you'll find information regarding your legal name and your preferred name, along with your program information. Ensure you read all the information detailed, and if any of the information is incorrect, then please contact the enrollment team to let them know of any changes in requirements. If the information is correct, then select Next in the bottom right-hand corner. On the next screen, you'll need to confirm your home address and term time addresses. If you do not already have a term address in place, please update this information. In most cases, this will require you to select Term, same as Home, and click on Add Term Address. This will take you to a further screen to confirm the address. Select the type of accommodation by clicking on the magnifying glass. Then click Next to move to the next screen. Now you'll be asked to provide accurate phone number information. Please ensure the information provided is correct should the university need to contact you. Work your way through the pages completing the relevant information and clicking next on each page. Within the other information page, you'll be able to provide your student support number if you are receiving a student loan. If you have a student loan in place already for your course, simply enter your student loan number here. If you are in the process of applying for a loan, you can inform the enrollment team with a copy of your application once you have completed your enrollment by emailing 
udol enrollment at derby.ac.uk. If this section does not apply to you, then leave it blank. Complete the remaining sections on this page and then click next to continue. For the next section, you'll want your study pattern opened in a separate tab or browser. Once again, you can access your study pattern from the UDO homepage. You'll next find a list of core modules and optional modules available to you for your program. Selecting the question mark will bring up the module details and descriptions so you can cross-reference this with your study pattern to ensure you have the correct module. Once you've found your module, click the select box and complete this step for all the available and optional modules you need to enroll onto. Once you have completed selecting your modules, select the enroll button at the bottom of the screen. You'll now see all the modules you have enrolled onto and all that is left to do is select finish and you will receive an enrollment summary. Now that you have finished confirming all your details and selecting your modules, all that is left to do is to make a payment. As previously mentioned, if you are being funded by a student loan and you have already entered this into the enrollment pages, you don't need to take any further action. If you have started to apply for finance, then please provide a copy of the application by emailing the enrollment team and be sure to include your student number in the email. If you are being sponsored, you will need to ensure that your sponsorship form is sent to the enrollment team. Please ensure that the full guidance is followed to ensure that the letter is accepted and your sponsor can be invoiced correctly. Any incorrect sponsorship forms can lead to a delay in your enrollment being confirmed. If you are self-funding, you will need to click on the How to Pay tile from the UDO homepage. This will take you to the university website and will provide you with options on how to pay. We have free payment plans available to self-funded students. If you want to pay in advance for the full program, you are entitled to a 5% discount. You can subtract this from the full fee and enter this into the payment portal. If you are enrolling in September and wish to pay for the full academic year, you will also be entitled to the 5% discount and you will need to pay 95% of your fee in the payment portal. Alternatively, you can go pay as you go. This will require 25% of the first module you are studying to be paid and then you will be provided with a payment schedule of 25% per month for the following three months. Payment is quickest and most effective through the payment portal, but if you are having to arrange a bank transfer, please note this can take several days to clear and may prevent you from being confirmed to the program in time to start your studies. Once you have made a payment, the enrollment team will check your record, ensure you're enrolled to the correct modules and confirm you to the course. It can take up to two days for you to receive your confirmation and welcome email from the university. Please watch out for it as it is your confirmation that you are able to access the course. Good luck with your studies here at the University of Derby Online Learning.